What's up, YouTube? My name's Chance. Channel is Chance Bishop's Breaks, and today uh, we have ourselves another Life TCG opening. This time, though, a little different. Uh, we have ourselves the first edition gold booster box. Woo! A little, little different. Uh, the difference is, I think, I believe it's a uh, number of hollows you pull. So, last two were just normal booster boxes. This is a first edition gold booster box. Uh, we are still looking for that one of one earth card. So, we're also looking for our number one chase card being the Pygmy Sloth. So, looking for a Pygmy Sloth Hollow. Looking for the Pygmy Sloth card. So, I think it's one of the more rare cards in the set. There's only Population roughly about a hundo or so. So, looking for that. We got our hair. We got a Alpine Ibex. First time we've pulled an Ibex uh, hollow. Here we go. Sleeve this bad boy up. Good old Alpine Ibex. Pack number two. Got the skunk, rat, giraffe. Got a jaguar. We've seen a couple jaguars in our time. So good old jaguar. Have a good old collection of jaguars, by the way, if you guys haven't seen our previous openings. I think one we got a. Uh, I think that's three Jaguar Hollows in one pack. Or one, one box. Gray Wolf. Humpback Whale. Hollow number three of the box. Population 84,000. Humpback Whales left in the wild. There we go. Pack four. Here we go. This is our, what is this, our third, fourth opening of this product. We've got a Wolverine. Oop, can't wear yet. There you go. Good old Wolverine hollow. So four packs, four hollows. Population about 30,000 Wolverines left in the wild. Uh, same as the Ibex, about twice as many as the Jaguar. Oh boy, it's a rat. Great wolf walrus. There we go. Pygmy sloth. Unfortunately, it's not the not the pygmy sloth hollow though, which is kind of unfortunate. Uh, yeah, hundred hundred population in the wild, so a little rarer of a uh, of a pull. Sloths, by the way, favorite animal. By far my favorite animal uh, of anything. So. If we can pull a pygmy sloth hollow, uh, call me, you know, call me happy. Oh, uh, yeah, porcupine, zebra, walrus, got a narwhal. First time seeing the narwhal, I believe. Good old narwhals are, it's a common, but I don't think we've seen one before. Yeah, so. Like, I like to see ones we haven't seen uh, before. All right. Beaver, boar, rat, zebra, humpback whale, squirrel, humpback whale, hollow. Second humpback we've gotten in the box. Second hollow. That's our second humpback hollow. It is our fifth total hollow in the box. We got a rat, beluga, sea hunter. We got orca. Orca's making their first appearance in uh, the box. We have a couple, got a couple orca cards too. So yeah, some of the ones with the bigger populations here. It's so like the orcas, the 
humpbacks. Put, we've put a couple of them, as opposed to, say, uh, the pygmy sloth. We've pulled uh, one rare pygmy sloth. Alright. Kangaroo. Moose. Orca is a spotted hyena. Jaguar. Uh, where we go? Oh. Where, where was it? Uh, hyena. That's what we had. So this is the, being the Orca. Now we have had a hyena. Good old hyena right there. Got a hedgehog, reindeer, beluga, chimpanzee, orca. We got a raccoon, polar bear, followed by a rhinoceros. Go. Got a rat. Now a gorilla, koala, lion, and a red panda. Got a rabbit, beluga, black panther. Pretty good movie right there. Ooh, we got a first edition, ten additional game cards. We got a gold pack. Okay, got a gold pack right here. Ooh, is this <laughs> is this a hot pack? Wild Ass, Blue Hill Koala, Dugong, Jaguar, Southern White Rhino, Snow Leopard, Bengal Tiger, uh, Great Anteater, and the Giant Otter. Wow. So we got a hot pack in here that came with 10 hollow rares. That's awesome. That is awesome right there. 10 hollow rares on, uh, on the gold pack right there. So we're going to have a bit of a recap to go through. I'm about to sleeve these all up, too. So we have our Wild Ass. So good old Wild Ass. We have our third different whale of the opening. Uh, if you want to consider a orca a whale or more of a dolphin. Uh, blue whale. We have ourselves a koala. I think we've put a koala a few times. Definitely pulled the dugong a couple times, so good old dugong added him back to the collection. So there you go, the dugong. We have our second jaguar. We have a southern white rhinoceros. About 10,000 left in the wild. Snow Leopard. Pulled him a few times. So, technically, uh, unlike other big cats, Snow Leopards can't roar. Uh, technically, that makes them not big cats. Yep. So there are a few criterias for big cats. Uh, one of them being retractable claws. One of them being the ability to roar. Bengal Tiger. That's the first time we've pulled the Bengal Tiger. Um... But yeah, snow leopards aren't considered big cats, and neither are cheetahs. They are big cats, but they are not technically big cats. Giant anteater. 5,000 or so left in the wild. We have the giant otter. Another about 5,000 or so left in the wild. Alright, moving on here, following our hot pack right there are... Ten go or ten rare, uh, hollow rares in one pack. Giant panda got a blue whale, a giant otter, and a spotted hyena. Ocelots back, porcupine, hippopotamus, koala, spotted hyena, jaguar. So that's our. Second spotted hyena we've got in this opening. So you see, population 50,000, a little more common. 
uh, then say the Bengal Tiger, which had 3,500. Or even the, the Anteater or Giant Otter population is about 5,000. So, Ocelot, Rabbit. We got another Pygmy Sloth right there. I'll take it. Sleeve up that Sloth right there, as I'm a uh, big fan of Sloths. Looking for that Sloth Hollow. If I get a Sloth Hollow, you know, I'm... That's it. I'm going to quit the channel, you know. <laughs> We're going to be done. I'm going to retire... Uh, we're gonna retire here for the channel if we pull a Sloth Hollow in, uh, I guess in our next two life openings. Got a mouse, chimpanzee, third hyena of the opening. Good old hyena. There we go. We got Wolverine for the hollow. That's our second Wolverine we've gotten. Right. So, of course, uh, as always for this product, uh, the link for the website to purchase the Life TCG packs is in the description down below. Uh, all part of proceeds do go to animal-related charities. Uh, so this was, you know, as someone who volunteered at the Philadelphia Zoo for multiple years, uh, it was something I can get behind. It's something I could feel good about uh, endorsing and doing openings about on on the channel. Um, now, none of this was free, by the way. I did purchase all products on the channel. Uh, were always purchased uh, via by me, or they were, say, like a gift via the holiday, like a girlfriend or a father. So I got me, got me some packs here and there. Uh, the Gagaur. Right there, about 25000 left in the wild. So, good old 25 k Zebra. <laughs> pack to pack packs. I forgot pulling one of the previous three openings. We've pulled two in today's opening. But you know, same as Pokemon though. Pokemon, you know, we have the same hollow rare three, four times, it seems like, in you know, the same opening, so. Not too, not too worried about correlation here or anything like that. Beaver, got seal. All right. Black seal, African lion. Be our hollow. So we got the king of the jungle, the African lion. So a uh, <laughs> we have a very big recap at the end. Of this, by the way, my little uh, tray pile of uh, hollows has begun overlapping and just kind of stacking now. Tasmanian devil. So, uh, unfortunate bit with the Tasmanian Devil is that uh, with the extinction of the Thylacine, also known as the Tasmanian Tiger, uh, which was the Tasmanian Devil's one natural predator, uh, populations for them have gotten out of control, as well as um, ones that have almost birth deformities that wouldn't have survived um, into adulthood. Because something would have preyed upon them. But since there's nothing to prey upon a Tasmanian devil. Uh, they are getting to adulthood. To adult mating age. And they are passing on those bad genes. Those bad characteristics. And then you're having 
you know, whole populations of Tasmanian devils that have really bad deformities. So, yeah, fun little Tasmania fact. Yeah, we got Chipmunk. All right, Wild Dog. Good old. I like, the, I like the elephant seal. Elephant seal is a fun one. Yeah, a couple packs left. Can we pull the pygmy sloth hollow? You got two pygmy sloths. No, I get it. The pygmy sloth hollow, there's only been a hundred of them. Well, there is only a hundred of them. The maned wolf. You've got plenty of maned wolves. You know, there are 25,000 left in the wild. But, good old maned wolf. Beaver, mouse, ring tailed lemur, African wild dog. They're like Three packs left after this. We'll have a recap. Koala. Our third gower. This is the first time we've seen the brown bear. Uh, brown bear, only a common. I don't believe we've seen that one before. There we go. Yeah, three packs left here in this one. Narwhal, manatee. It's been a while since we've seen a manatee. About 13,000 manatees left in the wild. So there you go. The only known predator of the manatee is humans. Probably because they're so big. Chimpanzee, koala, giant otter. All right, final pack here in today's opening. We'll have our quick little, it's not going to be quick, but we'll have a recap. The hedgehog, rabbit, polar bear, maine wolf, and snow leopard uh, rounds things out. So, all right, let's give, us, uh, let's give us a moment, collect ourselves, and we'll have a quick recap. All right, here we have our quick recap. Uh, we've pulled two humpback whales, population about 84,000 uh, left in the wild. We got two koala bears, population about 60,000 left in the wild. Only one orca this time, about 50,000 left. We had three spotted hyenas, about 50,000 of those left in the wild as well. Got the alpine ibex, about 30,000 population left in their natural habitat. We got two wolverines here, same thing with the ibex, about 30,000. We got the dugong, about 30,000 as well. The blue whale, about 25,000 of those. Got one maned wolf, population about 25,000. Got three gowers, population as well, about 25,000. They're known for their bad temper. One African lion, the uh, population about 20,000 left. One Tasmanian devil in their population, about 20,000. Now we have the two jaguars, population about 15,000 of those. We got the manatee, about 13,000 in population. Southern white rhino, about 10,000. Got the snow leopard, 7,000 left. We're going to start doubling these things up. Got the giant otter. About 5,000 left in the wild. 
the Giant Anteater. Same thing, about 5,000 left in the wild. We got the Bengal Tiger, about 3,500 uh, left in the wild. We got the Wild Ass, about 600 of those uh, left a lot around. And these aren't hollows, but it's the first uh, two times I've seen them. We have ourselves the Pygmy Sloth Non-Hollow Rare. World's slowest uh, mammal right there. Love me some Pygmy Sloth. Uh, but if you guys did enjoy today's opening, hit that like button, comment down below. Text time YouTube, though. Peace out, rock on, stay super classy. We'll catch you the next opening here on the channel.